Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome to the family. I'm here today with another video. So today we're going to look at a furniture market. As you all know, China is the best place to buy furniture. Well, there's a city that is popular for having markets that sell furniture and that city is called Foshan. If you want all the nice, unique, special, uh, modern, classy, classic stuff, you find it there. But today we're not going to go to Foshan. We just went to a small town called Hojie and this town is in a city called Dongguan. You get it? So let's see the stuff together in the video. So this is the market and it's so huge. It has maybe like four floors. The entrance, oh my goodness, it was beautiful. I felt like I was entering a garden of Eden. <laughs> you feel like you're in a different universe, a universe of style. It Ooh. felt like, I mean, another place, like a modern world. And some of the products that they have are couch, cushions, coffee tables, as you can see. And the chairs, I love the chairs. They looked so unique, like this yellow one. Oh my goodness, I loved it. This one, and this white bay was actually a chair, or should we call it a couch? And the aesthetics, wow, I was in a happy place. They also have beds pillows, bed sheets, and some chandeliers, the chandeliers, ooh, the chandeliers. Lamps, cardboards, and some of the ornaments that you can use to decorate your living room or your bedroom. And this place this place was breathtaking i felt like i was in paris i was telling my friend that this looks like we are in paris you can you imagine paris. this is like a decoration this shop is decorated like this and i was like what do you know the like, windows of the world how this is amazing Oh yes, then buy this. Ooh, this shop. I loved this shop. But mostly they have lamps and like bedroom stuff. Yeah, lamps, chairs, some cardboards, like those small cardboards that you can use. this frame this frame i was like wow wow it was really colorful and so nice i loved it hi 
I mentioned the deco, the deco, the deco was fire. I mean, look at this. This whole flower, can you call it a flower? Flower and a mix of bamboo. Actually, this is made out of bamboo. And this was an entrance of a shop and I was like, where are we going? Like, it, it was as if we're entering into a cave, you know? A cave of beautiful things. Oh my goodness. I also love this shop because all these chairs that they sell are so unique and special. The colors, the design, it's everything. And the fact that they give you an idea of how you can design your home or how your home can look like. like if you buy from us, this is what you get. You know what I mean? This part was mostly selling camping stuff. And this is a cushion. And this is, is like a jewelry or something. Can I call it jewelry? But it was made of metal and so heavy. It was so nice. I love this chair. And this frame, wow, this is the Great Wall of China. Remember I mentioned classic, yes, this is the classic part. I mean, who knew these things can still be found? So the next shop mostly sells cutlery, kitchen utensils, kitchen sets, everything was mwah, beautiful, amazing. And the shop owners mentioned that most of their products are actually designed for foreigners. When I say foreigners, it's like they design these to sell outside china because chinese don't really like this style so much maybe some but not much Imagine drinking tea in a gold cup. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. 
at first i was looking at this egg this egg shaped thingy that you're seeing and i was wondering what is that and then wow it's actually for cutlery it's amazing or oh, they also had some shops that sell like chinese tea uh furniture like those things that they use to drink chinese tea and this shop was so cool because some of their kitchen utensils are actually branded like chanel versace tiffany and co breathtaking i know i know this table this table was amazing it in the chair imagine these are made from shovels shovels people are so creative the video this is what i managed to record there was so much i think i would need two days to go there and just look at all those things that i saw today i'm so happy i'm satisfied if shipping was not that expensive i mean we're going to buy all this stuff that we see in china because it's mwah, it's so 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 beautiful it's so nice anyway thank you guys for watching this video give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe comment and share thank you